Hi, my name is Benson Chen. I'm a DSP acoustic engineer at Synaptic. I'm now wearing a headset powered by our latest headset solution, Iceland. Our Iceland headset solution has integrated Bluetooth, DAC, and USB connectivity all on the same headset. I can mix or listen to either, either one of the, the audio channel together uh, simultaneously. So uh, this is kind of like for the future of the call center? Uh, you, can, this is, you can call it the future of the enterprise headset. So for example, like you can have a connection with your phone. You can also have a USB connection to the PC to have a Zoom Teams call. And you can also have a that connection with your colleague next to you or in your uh, office. So here you have demonstration with the colleagues. I'm going to call you, and you're going to call them? Mm-hmm. All right. So right now you hear the YouTube video. Mm -hmm. And at the same time, the I can call comes the in. Call. All right. Hi, Roger. What's up? Can you hear me OK? Yeah, cool, cool, cool. Right. So uh, you know what? Let's uh, invite another colleague, Chad, to, to join the call. Chad, can you hear me? Hello, Chad. Can you hear me? Yes, OK. So let's talk uh, together. Let's enter in the conference mode. All right. Let me try uh, if you can show me your, your headphone system. Yeah, right sure. Here. All right, let me put the, the mic here. So we can hear the video, and the guys are talking also. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, so um, as in, how you are, you are uh, living in the, in the Computex? All right, cool. So they all can be talking at the same time, and that's cool. Yeah, and uh, uh, I, I, how soon is this ready, the solution? OK, so it's a, the engineering sample will be available on November, and the max production sample will be ready by uh, February. So this is the schedule for the development of the, the new uh, chipset. Is this brand new? Nobody does this in uh, the nobody world? Nobody really integrates like, everything like we do for now. So we kind of have the highest flexibility in terms of connectivity and different possible uh, solutions on different uh, headset scoops. And how about the DECT solution? It's, it's a special frequency spectrum? Yeah, the spe the, in the most uh, area, so the spectrum are using like 1.9 gigahertz instead of 2.4 like uh, Bluetooth. The 2.4 gigahertz are normally pretty busy. Like it has Wi-Fi, you have Bluetooth, you have Zigbee using 2.4 gigahertz. So it's not going to survive in a higher density like environment. Like everybody, there's lots of people using 2.4 gigahertz. It's not going to work. But for DAC, it has uh, like a pretty much uh, independent of uh, 1.9 gigahertz. So it will have a higher, uh, better communication uh, um, quality when there's a high, in the, under a high density environment. Nice. Um, and this, is this the little chip here? Uh, yeah, this is the little chip here. And it's going to be uh, directly into the headset? Yeah. In the future? All right. Cool. Okay. So thanks a lot. Yeah, thank you. Thanks.